Breaking news. Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinobo makes crucial confession about his running mate, causing serious reactions. Nigerians are wondering and say, really? You mean? Yes, yes. Buhari, uh, you know, not Buhari, uh, Tiko has already brought out his running mate, and that is the governor of Delta State. The person of Tinubu, uh, Peter Obi, and probably Konkoso have what we call dummy. So they just put in people there to be the running mate to beat up INEC deadline. But those people might not be the persons that may eventually end up running with them. This is all coming because INEC has fixed a deadline that they had to beat. So they just put in some names. However, those names that they have put there, you know, will have to be changed, you know, and um, this is what Tinubu has to say about his running mate causing, you know, serious reactions. Uh, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Breaking news. Tinubu makes crucial confession about his running mate. President Muhammad Buhari supposed successor, the winner of the All Progressive Congress primaries, Ashiwaja Ahmed Bola Tinubu, has revealed that he's yet to see his running mate. He made a declaration at the 60th birthday celebration of the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajagbe Amila. Recall that the APC candidate is yet to pick a running mate, even though another name has been substituted to INEC as a placeholder. Despite submitting a name to the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, has revealed he is, yet, he is still yet searching for his running mate. Tinubu made this known in Abuja while delivering his keynote address to the 60th birthday celebration of the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajagbe Mila. Channel's TV reports. The presidential candidate also heaped praises on the speaker for his contribution to his political ambition of becoming Nigerian's president and democracy. He praised him and says he has worked around the clock and Femi Bajawamila is a hardworking fellow, one Nigerians must look at and continue to support. He says the man supported him. He knows the role he played during the APC primaries, seeing to it that he, Tinobu, emerges as APC presidential candidate. What you don't know is that this man is a hardworking person, very hardworking. Which really believes in the people. And when he does, he gives everything possible to ensure that he delivers on that regards. Femi is a man who we all must contribute Lee supports, he loves Nigerians and does everything and will continue to do everything for the people. Femi, it's a man who has supported me and I will remain very grateful to him. So uh, at Femi's 60th birthday, Tinubu told everyone that he's still, you know, uh, he's, still, uh, he's still searching okay, for his running mates and says Nigerians should continue to support him in that regard, okay? You know, that Nigerians must continue to support him in that regard, that he's still searching, he has not stopped searching and is waiting patiently. So whether you like it or not, there are different people with different interests and everybody knows what they are looking at and looking for, as the case may be. You know, uh, Tinubu said he's still looking for the presidential candidates that could potentially, you know, be his running mate. And um, if a man is saying he's still looking for, then he's seriously still looking for. And um, we we'll all wait patiently to see who will eventually emerge as his running mate. And um, we must do all we possibly can to support and to ensure that, you know, such an individual, you know, uh, we are sure who we are voting for. And the only way to be sure who you are voting for, first of all, that you even vote, is for you to get your PVCs. Yes, get it too. Go get your PVC. I will get my PVC. 
let's get our PVCs. If you are residing in Nigeria and you know that you know um, you need this PVC, please get it. Don't dabble between opinions. Every one of us have got a duty of care to ensure that we vote in the right candidates, the right persons that could potentially, you know, begin to bring about policies and initiatives that could potentially drive Nigeria in the right way, in the right direction. So what is happening right now, clear indications on, you know, what's happening in the country and why things must change. You know, uh, Tinobu said he's still looking for his running mate because if you know very cleverly, we brought you up to speed, a video on that regards where uh, APC members, yeah, you know, go. they went on the street protesting against Tinubu, asking him why he has chosen, he is a Muslim and is choosing a northern Muslim if there are no Christians in the whole of APC and in the whole of the north that could be his running mate. So because they feel that their interest are not, is not protected. So these are some of the things going on. And everybody is waiting to see how this whole thing will play out. Well, my wonderful people, that time again is now. Elections are around the corner and the only way we can secure our future largely as we pray, as we do every other thing, as we, we, we're really looking forward for, to Nigeria changing, is for us to get our PVC. So uh, if you don't get your PVC, I don't get mine. We are really deceiving ourselves, seriously deceiving ourselves. And if we really want things to really change, then we must go ahead, get our PVCs and vote for the potential right candidates that could make, you know, the whole lot of difference. Other than that, <laughs> it's it's really, it's really a work, it's really a mirage. A mirage is that, you know, that pool, supposedly pool of water you see on the road on a hot sunny day when you're driving. Apparently, it's the expansion of the road and so is the heat. The expansion of the road and the heat emanating, you know, as a result of the sun, the rail of the sun hitting on the quota with the, you know, that intense heat is what is forming that uh, supposedly water pool you can see right in front, but you never get to read. So it is what it is. Let's make up our minds to bring about a difference. God bless you. Please don't forget. Remember, you have a voice. Let's speak out against everything and anything that will not move us forward. Have a lovely and a fantastic day. Vote, vote, vote. But it starts with you getting your PVCs. Get it. God bless. Bye for now.